Ladies and gentlemen of the internet, welcome, welcome, welcome. So we're here today with the finale of season one of Kindaichi. The first season, the, f se the season one finale. And I'm actually very excited to see this conclusion of the last episode, well, of this two episodes, This with this episode obviously being the third episode. So I, I can't wait to see the conclusion of this three episode little mini arc uh, and see whether I was right. I think I'm right. Of course I think I'm right. But then again, why wouldn't I think I'm right? You know, I, I wouldn't I, I wouldn't say a theory if I thought, if, if I didn't think I was right. Now, I can't wait to be proven wrong, but I might be proven right. And I just, for, for that chance, for the opportunity to be proven right, I gladly will be wrong. <laughs> if, those, if that makes sense. Anyway, with that said, episode 25, the season one. Oh, shoot. All right. Uh, ooh, this has just changed a few things for me. Uh, yeah, that's fine. You know what? That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. You don't know what I'm talking about, but that's fine. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, season, season one, episode 25, the final episode of this season. We're going to get started with this episode in three, two, one. That's a bit loud, but that's very loud. better by the way if you want to get early access you can do so over on patreon currently uh, I'm give or take four episodes ahead with every show um, with Kendaichi I'm a bit further ahead because I used to be further ahead and well we're just keeping that same pace in it for most shows I'm trying to be you know more than four episodes ahead but that's obviously gonna take a few weeks before I'm able to do that uh, so if you're watching this in the future, and you like, you know, shows that I'm doing, including obviously Kendaichi, uh, by the time you see this on YouTube, we should be, you know, deep into the second season. Whether that's actually going to be the case or not, well, it will be the case, but yeah. <laughs> if you want to know exactly how far I am ahead on Patreon, you could always just, you know, message me on Twitter. Or just leave a comment down below and I'll respond to it whenever I get to it, which, you know, I, I do see all the emails. I, I do see all the comments that people leave because I get emails for them. Although I might not always respond to them. Damn. One second, though. Alright, I'll just have to sort this out afterwards. Uh. Sorry about that. Prove you right. Prove me right. <laughs> Is you. Let's not play Among Us and tell me I'm right. Tell me I'm right. I don't know how the second one was committed, but tell me I'm right. No.
That which makes sense, of course. Man's brought out the whiteboard. The whiteboard. The next wife, eh? just came in here just to be a badass. <laughs> really? She's not the killer. No. She's the one that benefits from it. She's the one that ben... Yeah. Feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> it feels good. Yeah. True. And then the most important when she stopped her from how would you know that though and then when they swapped it the antidote probably the broth Makes sense. Ah, swapped, swapped. Yep, yep. That I clocked on. That I clocked on. I want to know how he killed. I need to know how. No. I thought toilet etiquette. Toilet etiquette. But I still don't know how that... Damn. Damn. I did. I, I should actually figure that. I actually know about that as well. An etiquette label. But you can't have an etiquette label for everything though. That's how I don't. I, I mean, I didn't know how you did that one either, but. <laughs> there must have been like a hidden message. Don't say what if, tell me how. <laughs> oh. It's a. Uh, what do you call it?
everyone but her. Yeah. It's not even that. It, uh, what, what do you call it? Hidden ink. Okay, I thought it was like, you know, a hidden ink. Oh, that's even, that's even way more clever. Okay, no, that's <laughs> that's way above me. <laughs> that's that's way above me. All right. Um, nah. <laughs> How you figured it out? I don't know, bro. That is just too much. That is too much. Damn. Okay, now. Nah. If... If anyone in real life ever did anything like that, they would get away scot-free. They would get away scot-free. How did you not figure that out? The second he said inheritance, you should be like, wait, are you my mother? <laughs> like, come on. But nah, if, if anyone does this in real life, they never get the cup. They never get. I don't care about all. About all the scientific advancements. Oh, I love this shot. I love this shot. That's why she's wearing that. That's probably... None of you found it strange that she's got pink hair. <laughs> Just saying. Nah, she's saying that on purpose. Smoking, stress smoking. Ooh, he always tea. There's always another. <laughs> now, what a way to announce that. What a way to say that. That's ruthless. It wasn't even him, it was her. insurance as a scum that's, 
That's sad to hear, to read and hear. She was clinging on to life. Damn, that's that's oh my goodness this show is hardcore sometimes <laughs> that must be freaky just seeing that I don't even know. Nope. <laughs> and she, you know, was able to do it. That's where the idea came from. And then... But I understand. Damn. <laughs> Damn. I don't even know what to say. This is hardcore. Two peas of the same pod. to go out there. We know you want to. Don't tell me that was... Is this episode? Nah, she's going through it. You think your mother's dead. Then you find out she's alive. And then she's actually... <laughs> oh, that is ridiculous.
the fuck is this episode? <laughs> well, she's a fool. Nah, I would have been spending that. Lavishly. I'd be in the Bahamas, bro. Bro, what the f- What the f- This episode is wild. Absolutely wild. What else am I supposed to say about wild? <laughs> You two should take a lesson from those two. Bro, what the f This... Yo, don't hit me with flat one of those, alright? Like us. Okay, come on. That was... Don't... 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 No. No. It's less sight. <laughs> less sight. I could forgive those since they're still young, but... Look, alright? Thanks, see you. And that's the end. Alright, I'll say it right now. This free part was by far, by far, the best case of this show. By far, by leaps and bounds, alright? I love the, like, the mystery, right? Absolutely love the mystery. And then we get to this ending. I predicted who it was. I saw some of the context clues, but to them be hit with that ending, bro. <laughs> it wasn't. Let me get this right, right. It wasn't a dark ending. It wasn't a dark ending. That's not why I like it so much. It was a raw ending. And you don't always get that in anime. Like a, a raw emotion, a raw ending. Not ending, but like a raw emotion, like a raw scene, like just people being raw. Because the issue with anime is, you know, a lot of the times, it just feels like over the top. Over the top goodness, over the top your know, badness. Um, it just feels out there, you know, for lack of a better term. It feels like, oh yeah. This is clearly not like people wouldn't react like that in real life, you know. That's how it feels like sometimes. Not not just sometimes. A lot of the times it just feels like, oh yeah, people wouldn't react like that. Like what's going on here? Like why are people just going over the top? You know? This is the one time I'm like, yo, bro. This is raw. This is real. This is gritty. This is grimy. That's what this is. This is this is, you know, that that's that's that person that's down the pub, that's down the dumpster. I could I, I could imagine them coming up with something. Like, granted, they, they would never have a plan this smart. But if they're dying, you know, if their child is in debt and they don't want to, you know, and if, you know, they've gone through all that circumstances, I could see them do this absolutely 100%. This episode is raw. Oh, I feel good. I feel, I feel like I just watched greatness. <laughs> like, the show as a whole, right? If I had to like rate, I'm not giving I'm not giving a number because it's very. Um, I don't want to say villain of the week esque, but it's very much you know a different case, and you might like one case more than another, so on and so forth. So it's very much you know depending on if you like X Y and Z, then X Y and Z uh will be something that uh you know if if that corresponds to you, then you're gonna like that more, and because it's very villain of the week esque, obviously with longer story plot lines. 
it feels almost like how would i go about describing it it's difficult to judge because it can be so varied like you can love something a lot and then the next episode you know the next arc uh could be something that you don't care too much about but as a whole the way i can describe this is if this show had i'm gonna compare it now with something but if this show had you know a thousand episodes like detective conan i probably would be watching a thousand episodes like that's kind of like it's it's in a very similar i mean it, obviously it's it's very much like you know the same genre but it's in a very similar ballpark to detective conan where in a way i almost don't want to react to it in a way i just want to like that's that's how i kind of watch detective conan like with detective conan I don't focus on it. The way I watch it is I have, you know, I have it on this monitor. I know, while I'm like, playing games or something on this one, if that makes sense. You know, that's that's how I watch the TF Code. Like, I, I binge it without be my full focus being on it. And some of you might say, well, for a show like Tech of Conan or for a show like Indaichi, how would that work? Because you need to pay attention. But that's why I said I, I wouldn't these wouldn't be shows that i typically would react to i think that i would want to react to because when i'm not paying attention like when i'm playing a game and there's just something is on whether that's you know, a crime or whatever i go back like 10 times like like you know i watch something and i see and i, and I don't see something i miss something you know because I'm, I'm too focused on x y and z on this screen i'm like oh let me just you know rewind 10 seconds here let me just rewind 20 seconds here and so i see multiple scenes multiple times and i'm just able to pick out a lot more i feel like if i were to, maybe i would i don't think i would have gotten the sommelier pad honestly i don't think i would have gotten that um but that's kind of what the show feels like it feels like a show that i just kind of want to just sit back and binge <laughs> like like just sit back and binge that's kind of what it feels like and there is as i said this this last arc it's by far the best. It's by far. It's it's by far the best. It is just simply outstanding. All right. It's simply outstanding. That was just great. That was just great to watch. Those three episodes were just great to watch, and this one was by far the best. Damn, I'm really excited for season two now. I hope season two keeps this up. I hope season two keeps this up and shows us, you know, more of this kind of uh, greatness. Because that, that, that three-parter is worthy of ending the first season. Honestly, it's worthy of ending the first season. It is just that good. Oh, I want to see more now. <laughs> like, ah, I want to see more now. With that said, ladies and gentlemen, as I said at the beginning of the episode, if you want to see more, you know, if you want to get early access, you can do so over on Patreon.com. As I said, currently four episodes ahead. I am, as I said also, I'm trying to, you know, get further ahead, but that's going to take a few weeks. Probably July is when I'm going to be like, you know, more than just four weeks ahead. Well, not four weeks, but four episodes ahead. That's probably when it's going to be like multiple episodes ahead. But, A, it do be like that. Anyway, I'll see all of you first season. Until then, have a nice day. Peace out. And as always, bye. Let me know what you all thought about this season as well. Just in general, what's your what's your favorite case of this season? I'd, I'd very much love to know. You know, maybe you've got a completely different favorite. Let me know. Uh, with that said, peace out, everyone. Have a nice day and bye.